What's up? It's Charlie Cherise. How y'all doing? Do y'all like my new setup? See, y'all don't see the back door no more. It's my office, except I switched it around a little bit so you can see my little sticky notes I have, but it's still in the kitchen. So you also see my coffee maker and my dish rack. <laughs> but, um, uh, man, y'all, a lot has happened since the last time we talked. I miss y'all so much, and I'm so happy that I can come back. I got an unboxing. You know, I got a few things that I want to unbox because I've ordered a few things. I've done a lot of things. Guys, a lot has transpired from the last time uh, <clears throat> I pressed the red uh, square to record. Um, good, bad, and everything in between. Um, but God always will have the victory. Y'all see my little situation right here <laughs> so um i usually you know I'm, I'm healing right now my face from a breakout and usually i don't do anything to my face when i break out i just kind of let it go through its course and i just baby it with a little bit of um witch hazel and then i moisturize my face and i just i let it do its thing i don't mess with it i don't try to like you know pop it or anything but yeah you know hormonal flare so it's probably either before if it, if I haven't already had that time in the month and it's probably coming or something like that when I break out that big but it's really swollen and yesterday it was way bigger than this so and yesterday I was just like I'm not getting on camera I, I just can't like this is big still but imagine it being like three times as worse as how it looks right now so it's actually going down a lot as far as the swelling so I'm happy and I was like look let me get on we're women, you know, we know we have those those moments when <laughs> we break out, okay? Um, that's what they call that thing, PMS or something like that. I don't know. Mm -mm, I don't know. But anyway, today is uh, self-care Saturday. Um, I can't pinpoint something specifically I did as far as self-care. Oh, okay. So I would say doing my face. And then my hair as well. I see. I know y'all see um, that I have my scarf on. But I'll let my hair down so y'all can see. I'm going to get into the unboxing. But listen, we have a lot to talk about, y'all. It's been a minute and a lot has happened, okay? Uh, a lot of accomplishments. A lot of, you know, trial and error. Um, but so my hair, I don't know if you can tell, but my hair half is like retightened and half is not i'm still working on it but yeah so um as far as self-care today like i said i did my face with witch hazel and i just kind of let you know i'm just letting my breakout heal itself and then um, i'm starting to do my my hair so on this side it's retightened um and i'm going through little by little um i never do my hair when i retwist my hair i never retwist it in one sitting um I just can't even do it um, in one sitting anymore because I'm so used to either having to, you know, figure out what Cooper's up to or stopping, you know, cook dinner or, you know, you know, be a mommy. So, um, he, it was at one point when he wouldn't even let me retwist my hair when he was younger. He would always just grab my hand. Like, if he saw me up here twisting or doing something, he would just take my hands away from my hair and just be like, no. How do you say that to me? No, he didn't want nothing. My hands doing nothing but holding him. But anyway, so yeah, I'm retwisting. I'm doing hand rolling and, and um, crochet. Not crochet. Am I saying it right? Crochet and using the crochet hook to um, retighten. So I'm doing a, a mixture of both because some of my uh, locks have jewelry on the end. So the ones who that I can't crochet, um, I'm going to hand roll. And sometimes I can do hand rolling and crochet on um, on some of them. On most of them, I can do hand roll and crochet. But anyway, so that's... I, you know, y'all, I need to do a, 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 a lock story. I just realized that, that I said I was going to do a lock story. So I'll do a lock story. I'll post that. Um, I have a lot of things that I need to post. I have a lot of things I need to post. And... I have a lot of things that I have to tell you guys, but I, I wouldn't dare sit here in this one video and try to tell y'all every single thing. Because number one, I probably won't remember everything, you know, in order and everything, and I'll probably forget details. And then two, 
you know, I want to just take my time and just, you know, go on this journey together with you guys um, to present moment and then what we're doing, you know, from here. But yeah, I got to catch y'all up first because we got a lot going on. But anyway, so I'm going to put my, uh, I'm going to put my scarf back on in a minute. <clears throat> but um, I'm kind of liking this because the lighting in, he in here is weird. So that actually kind of gets me into... Okay, that might be a little better. That kind of gets me into um, the unboxing because one of the things that I got was a... Um, I'll get into it in a second. But first, before I do that, um, I just want to say I have a new setup. Like I said, for this channel, there's a new setup. I will not be recording in here. And um, once I show y'all, once I reveal the setup, I will let y'all know the whole story behind it and everything like that. But that is uh, forthcoming. I got a planner. Look, and I've been planning. You see all this stuff in here? All of these things that I have to do? All right, it says make today. Make today amazing. So I got a planner. I've been planning things. We're going to get a lot of, um, of different studies. So I have my little, I, I, I'm calling this my mommy journal, my mommy my single mommy journal and I'm and I'm doing a study in this book right here uh, it's called train up a mom okay so um, this is something that I got a while back from my uh, from my church and I was doing a study in here and I'm gonna finish that up and I want to share that with you guys because I want to do I'm this is gonna be more I'm gonna transition this channel more into like a, a vlog like a mommy vlog single um single mommy vlog or just you know single woman vlog um and so i'll have certain days where i'm doing the vlog the single mommy vlogging i'm doing the single lady vlogging i'm doing the you know the love wait vlog or whatever right waiting for love and everything so it'll be a different day um you know, say maybe just Mondays, I'll do a regular vlog, you know. Uh, and I really like doing the Mass Mondays. I really enjoy doing the Mass Mondays, so I want to bring that back and we can, you know, work on that. Plus, I'm making my own, uh, I, I have a recipe for my own coffee scrub that I'm going to uh, show y'all how. Maybe that'll be the first Mass Monday. The first Mass Monday, when we're officially back will be my own coffee scrub that I'm using on my face. And I'll tell y'all everything that's in it. It's all food. Um, it's all edible. And I'm going to mix it up and put it on my face. I've been using it and it's doing my skin really good. I know you can't tell right now because I'm just having, I'm having a, a, a hormonal breakout right now. So don't judge me. All right, don't judge me. But that coffee, that coffee scrub that I made works. My skin was looking so flawless. I should have saw it like, uh, a week, uh, let me say a week and a half ago, you should have seen my pictures. They was luscious and delicious. But right now my face is swollen. Not just in that area, it's kind of just swollen. And there's, if you can't tell, there's a lot of fine bumps all over my face. And that happens when I'm like right in that, around that pocket of time when I'm uh, hormonal and PMSing and all of those things. So... I don't know if it's before or after or in between or on it. I don't know. But right in that little area, right in that few weeks before, during, and after that my face does a thing. So that's the thing that it's doing. What? Well, that's enough of that. We got to get into it. Okay, y'all? So I just want to tell y'all that. Um, and I usually don't do unboxing on this channel, but I'm doing it because this is where I can just chill out and relax. I ain't got to be Chef Charlie. I ain't got to do a lot, okay? I just don't have to do too, too, too much, all right? So, before I show y'all that, I'm going to show y'all this. Even though I have to, um, even though I do have to return these, I still want to show them because I got the wrong size. But these are, um, Paw Patrol. Paw Patrol bedroom shoes for my book for my boy, um, but I got the wrong size. I don't know what I was thinking. I, I I ordered the wrong size, thinking I don't know what I was thinking. I felt like I was looking at the numbers as in his age instead of um, as in his shoe size. So I got a 
I'm five six, thinking, oh yeah, he's four, so he's between the ages of five. I don't know why I thought that it was age and not sh shoe size. That I don't even know what I was thinking. But anyway, so I clicked five and six, and then I knew they were too small before I even opened this bag. Like when I opened, when I when I felt the bag, I was like, mm -mm. I was like, these these feel small, and then. I remember and I was like, oh, I, I did five and six like it was age. So that was my bad. So I have to drop these back off to the UPS store. And um, once I drop them back off to the UPS store, um, they'll send me the right size. So I had got those for Coop. I got some of these little bags right here. And I'm... Um, I have to get another part to this. I ordered this. This came in the same bag with the shoes. But I have to get another part to this. But these are just like little treat bags. You open them up. And you can put different little stuff in it. And so um, I'm thinking about doing a little, um, some little homemade cough drops for my clients. And sending them off. You know, as just like a little gift. And um, I'm just going to, it'll probably be like two or three cough drops. And I put them in there. Like so, like that. So, see, that's the inside. It's not opening for me for whatever reason. It's not staying open. But anyway. Yeah, so that's what the bag looks like. So, about... Two, like two or three I would say three cough drops can fit in there and um, send them to my clients and the other part that I'm waiting on is I have to get the part that seals this I did not order that so that's uh, 75 of these or 100 or something like that so yep I'm working on a few projects for my clients and so I'm ordering some things so this is just an unboxing of all my stuff that I've ordered. These are, these things are more recent. Um, but I also order mommy things, stuff for Coop and everything like that. Stuff for this channel, stuff for my other channel, for my um, Instagram and everything like that. So this is another thing that I'm super excited about. I already opened it. But it is a lavalier microphone because I realized when I watched my videos back that there that I I I speak lower, you know, when I'm trying to I guess when I'm trying to like get a point across or I'm trying to maybe do a punchline, I'll say something and it's funny, but I can't hear it. Like I know what I said, so I laugh, but I realize that you guys probably can't hear me. So I was like, all right, you know what? To make my videos a lot more professional um, I want to get a little microphone so that way you can hear everything and this reduces background noise and it's just a little clip clip microphone you could just clip it like uh, you said some people say you could clip it on your shirt but um, or you could just clip it like on the table have it sitting here and clip it on like the side of your table like this and it plugs into your um your cell phone or your tablet or whatever it's a universal plug so i'm excited about it it's by mavo um i don't remember how much it was uh i think it was like 20 ish or between 20 and 30 dollars i can't remember it wasn't 30 though it was it was between it was like 20 something but anyway, so I'm really excited about that because this will be the last video that y'all may or may not be able to hear everything that I'm saying. Oh, I got money in there. Oh, I done took some money away. Ain't nothing but a, ain't nothing but a few dollars, but still, I, I didn't even realize that I had put the money in, in this little thing. It just looked like it's supposed to have money in it. So for whatever reason, I stuck $4 in there along with the microphone uh, after I opened it. Um, but I haven't put it to use yet because, I, like I said, I want to do the unboxing. So, 
now I've unboxed it and so the next video I'll set everything up I'm really excited about this I got a lot more stuff to unbox so let me hurry up okay but um I want to just come with so so many different types of videos I'm gonna do single mom self-love women's coaching etc okay so this is the big bottom bottom I got a ring light stand for my phone so now I know a lot of times um I know a lot of times my phone will fall like right now it's leaning up against a wine bottle um and that's a good setup for me here now but now with our ooh, it has little it has a little controller with some buttons that that feels fancy already but um so you know just to make the videos a little more higher quality looking lighting because right now the lighting even though it's bright it's still a little you know it's just hitting different so i think that the ring light will probably help oh and it's it's nice and sturdy it doesn't feel flimsy or anything it's like it's really you know look at that that looks really professional let's take that off oh, that looks nice look at that so you just and it has a clamp i like i pers i specifically wanted the clamp because i know that it'll clamp right here on the end of my table my desk Ooh, look guys this is so great now obviously it's not gonna be this close to my face or anything but still and then something seems to be missing Oh, here we go. This is the clip for your phone. How do you make it? Does it come with directions? Okay, it snaps on there, and this oh, okay, okay, and then you. Okay, so it's on this swivel little swivel ball. Can y'all see? It's on the little. Bring it down a little bit. It's on the little swivel swivel ball, so you can move your camera in any different direction. But I'm trying to get this thing to screw on because it appears it's supposed to screw on. Okay, here we go. So screw it on to hold it in place, like so, like this. I'm sure you know you guys have seen one of these before, right? And it seems pretty self-explanatory, which is why there isn't directions in the box or on the box for that matter. If there were directions, there definitely aren't directions. We got the microphone. And we have the ring light. I'm trying to figure out how to. This is for. What is this for? This is for. Plug up to plug up the light. This is to plug up the light. So I need, um, oh, I must need a little. 
the 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 attachment. Hold on. Charge it. Okay. I don't know if y'all just saw like my entire butt or not. So when I wash this back, I don't know. So I guess I need this. in oh look it's glowing blue that means we've got power people oh <gasps> y'all look at how great this lighting is right now that makes such a difference y'all this is lit <laughs> literally it's lit yes I like this one. This one makes me look great. I can't even see the little bump I have on the other side. Just Okay, sorry guys. I'm pink. <laughs> this is cool. Okay, so anyway, let's finish the unboxing. I'm going to try to finish this unboxing so the video isn't so long. But this is so cool. This just makes everything look awesome. Can I tell y'all something that I'm obsessed with right now? Snack break because I just got a little hungry. Okay, turn, turning it off now. And I'm plugging it. Okay, so I want to tell y'all something I'm, I'm kind of kind of obsessed with right now as far as snacks. Because I actually kind of got a little hungry right now when when I was messing with this light. I just I need a little munch. So, look what I have fallen in love with recently. Where is it? Oh. These chips. Is it upside down? Oh. These chips. I love these chips. They're so good. And it's a little later than midnight, so we'll just call this a late night snack. Anyway, I have more unboxing too. Let's us hurry. Let us hurry before midnight strikes and we are locked out forever. All right, y'all. This thing is bendy, but I'm. I just hope I don't bend it. Bend it to the point of no return. That would be breaking it, I guess. That's what I'm trying to say. I don't want to break it. It seems so easy to. Let me put this back on. It seems so easy to move, and I'm so tempted to move it a lot. So I don't want to do that. But this is cool. This ring light, man. I wish I knew how great that that was. I would have been got one of these. Okay, I'm bending it back into the box. And I'm trying to be gentle with the light part. Okay. So put that away. She's gonna put these over here. Yeah, so this 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 is a little better of a office setup. I can there's a whole shelf back here with all of my supplies on it. So I just turn around and get whatever I need from back there. So I love this setup more. It's more space over here, so it makes it feel more officey while it's still being in the kitchen. I love it. I love it, but it I realize that it's not. It's not the space for this channel. I'm just having to do this unboxing here, but we got our own little setup. And I, I just dropped the box. We got our own little setup. I'll put this back here. We have our own little setup for this channel, and it's so cute. I can't wait for you guys to see it. All right. 
Ooh. Okay, so this one. And this one I'm sure has a few things in it because I ordered a few things. More than one thing. They just like to put everything in one box. Because the stuff that I ordered was small. So. a stapler and this is a whole desk setup behind me y'all y'all be able to see it once i get it. everything i'm excited I have a stapler on my desk i don't know why but i just feel so i just feel like a stapler on your desk makes it officially an office you know Y'all uh, recently saw, before this video, the last thing I um, uploaded was a poem called Coffee Queen. So, if y'all are watching this, y'all more than likely already saw that. And if y'all haven't, go check it out. I dedicated a poem to my best friend for her birthday. And um, I'm going to actually redo it because that video that I uploaded was the actual dedication video and I did it just right off the top of the like I had written it down I just did it right off a of notebook paper but I'm gonna do a, a do a better job because this this space this channel will also be used for my poetry which I've been a poet most of my life since I was about nine or ten I've been a poet when I first learned how to write poetry in middle school and I wish I could remember my teacher's name. I do not remember her name. Ooh, packing things. Packing. Packing. Yeah, I have a lot of little stuff. In this little box. So what do I want to show y'all first? I don't even know what I want to show y'all first. I'll show y'all this first. This, so, as y'all know, Cooper recently uh, came back home and his dad, he was with his dad for a few months and um, sorry, he was with his dad for a few months and his dad was getting his hair cut. But when he came back with me, he was like, I don't want to get my hair cut anymore. And getting his hair cut has always been a hassle for me. Number one, I do not like to be in a barbershop. If anybody knows barbershops, and know barbershops is like a man's sanctuary. They be in there doing them, you know, checking out the booty and cussing and, you know, whatever. And so I always feel very awkward in that type of setting. I just feel like I'm like on a chopping block where I'm just walking by and everybody's staring at me and it's just an awkward feeling because I'm a very um, confident woman. Um, but even that situation kind of like nips at my confidence. Like I just feel like my whole soul is like bared and they're just staring, gawking and just, it just makes me feel uncomfortable. So I said all that to say um, that I don't enjoy taking him to the barbershop. So I, I decided to let him grow his hair out. And he loves my hair. And he always says, Mommy, I want my hair to be long like yours. Now, I realize that he may not be old enough to make that decision. But he has a long time before his hair is long enough to lock. So he can change his mind if he wants to. I said all that to say I had to get him this. Because if I'm going to grow his hair out. Then I have to wash it. I have to keep it washed and conditioned and moisturized and clean. And so, um, this is, I saw this on Instagram. Not this exact one. And I couldn't find the exact one that I saw on Instagram. But, um, this is basically like a, a, wa a wash cap. 
and basically um it just it protects the, the child's eyes and ears from the water because Cooper does not like for water getting his face he starts to like freak out I'm trying to open it so y'all can see it and um I was like he freaks out when he get his hair cut he freaks out when I wash it I'm just like okay we got we gotta figure something out so I saw this and I was like this is gonna be perfect I got him some new shampoo And everything to go with this and so i'm going to introduce this to him so it, it's like velcro here and you just put it on the head like this and it covers their ears and you just snap the oh the velcro is sticking to my hair um and then you just snap the velcro in the back behind their heads so I think he's gonna really like this because this is this means no more water in his face. So I'm sure he's gonna love that. It's like a little visor. So that's that's that. 